So the way it will start is I will receive the brief, I'll write a director's treatment and I will pitch for the idea. Hopefully we win the idea and then we move into the pre-production. I basically um, bring my ideas to life, storyboard always everything I storyboard. You have to, it's a clear way of knowing what's going on and it's a beautiful way to align the team on the day. With what I do is I assemble my crew. I basically act as a producer as well as a director so I'll assemble the crew, I'll find out the locations and, and that's basically how we make the thing happen. On the day when we shoot, it's my job to assemble the crew, but more importantly, it's my job to direct the show. You know, the whole thing is up to me, really. Performance of the actors or, or models or talent, making sure they feel comfortable, making sure everything runs smoothly, but more importantly, making sure we stick to that storyboard that we've created. I can't stress how important a storyboard is. A storyboard is basically this, the bare bones of a structure and it's kind of, without a storyboard, it's, it's like a, a heart surgeon going in uh, without any of his tools. <laughs> <laughs> that guy gonna die. Post-production. As a director, I also uh, oversee the post-production side. Uh, that's an exciting time. The edit is important. Sometimes I'll take it on myself. It really depends on the level. I am a documentary filmmaker. I do like to get involved in the edit. Uh, with documentary, a lot of the uh, content actually is revealed in the edit. A lot of the stories can be told uh, better during you know, good editing practices. So yeah, I like to be involved as much as I possibly can.